hopefully it's not nothing serious. You know, that's, that's my first reaction. Um, we didn't get back up. You know, it felt like um, something was wrong. So um, hopefully, you know, we get some good news tomorrow and he's, he's back with us. Um, no time, no time. Well, you, you, you talked a little bit about it. Um, you know, in, in LA, kind of what he brings, but you know, in your two years here now, what, just your idea of kind of the heartbeat he is of, of this room. Yeah, um, he's the voice of the soccer room, to be honest with you. You know, um, he's the one that's talking before games. You know, he's the one that's, that's bringing us together. Um, and, you know, it's going to be tough to lose that if, if we have to, but hopefully, like I said, you know, we're going to pray and everything's okay. Uh, he's back with us soon. You said defensively at practice yesterday that the goal was to do it again today. Yeah. How do you feel you guys did in terms of consistency, in terms of effort? Excellent. Excellent. I think the um, attention to detail was there. Um, I'm not sure what they shot from the three-point line, but that was a main point of emphasis, you know, getting them off the three-point line, not letting them um, make threes. You know, they had 19, you know, a few games before. So that was a point of emphasis. So attention to detail and, and the effort was definitely there. You guys have had two games now where you've battled through adversity. How have you seen some of these younger guys mature in those moments? Well, you just got to throw them out there and see how they, <laughs> what happens. You know, I think that's, you know, the, the biggest part of, of the learning, you know, and experience is being a part of it, you know, being out there and, and getting the feel of it and a, and a touch of it. And um, these guys are out there, you know, they're rising to the occasion every night. There's a lot to choose from given the line that he put up, but what impressed you most about Nicola's night? Um, the donkey he had. <laughs> that was definitely, you know, the most important thing. Triple doubles, we, we know that. Yeah. <laughs> but the dunk was impressive. When he has nights like that, what's it like being out there alongside him? It's great. You know, um, we all eat off him. You know, he feeds us all. <laughs> you know, um, things are clicking. You know, offense is clicking. Um, but most importantly, you know, with the job that he did on the defensive end was, was really important for us. Did you like the way that he, I mean, to go after a rookie, I mean, he started right, I think the three out of the first four possessions, you know, he was isolating against, you know, eight and kind of seeing what this guy has, how he guards. Did you like that? I mean, to, the, as a tone setter kind of deal? I love it. You know, I, every time he did it, you know, I was like, just keep going yeah. all night long, all night long. And um, for a guy like that, as young as he is, to, to smell that and, and attack that, you know, um, that's what we need from him to stay aggressive and, and do things like that. How much do you think the defense set the tone for offense, especially in that second half? Um, a lot. I think we came to the bench, and our main focus was uh, when we were up was continue to play defense. You know, it's, it's starting on the defensive end. Um, and guys got out there and they continue to compete, continue to run guys off the three point line and, and scramble all night. So, how do you carry over that defensive intensity to tomorrow's game? Quick turnaround. Quick turnaround. You know, but um, just like I said in practice the other day, um, we'll see how we're going to act tomorrow. You know, it's, it's it's a game by game, you know, thing for us. You know, how, how how can we create habits? You know, we want to build good habits, you know, especially on the defensive end. And um, the only way to do that is one game at a time. And tomorrow is going to be a, a really tough test for us. Um, but I feel like we can do it. How good can Nicola be as a scorer? We know he can play make, but 11 of 11, 35 points. Um, as good as he wants to. He can shoot every shot. He probably, <laughs> you know, <laughs> average 40 if he wanted to. You know, with him being unselfish, you know, he wants, he wants to get a and get everybody else involved. So, um, as good as he want to be, man. <coughs> Thanks, Paul.